put that in a little clip on. That's nice. Oh, my God. You never get sick of that, do you? Oh, no. This is, this is my uh, third appearance on a talk show, so this is all kind of new to me, and it's amazing. Thank you very yeah, much. We're, we're, we're... You know, you should, you should relax, though. Technically, we're not really a TV show. <laughs> we're sort of a radio show. We don't know what we are, exactly. Oh. You know, I just, I just met you for the first time I went backstage. Yes. Tried to surprise you in your dressing room. Didn't work. But, uh, <laughs> but I wanted to tell you that um, uh, I, I really like your name. I've always liked your name. When, I first, when you first became a star, I always loved the name Winona. Oh, It's very pretty. You. Do you have thank other... You. I mean, I have a, a freakish name. And I was, I was the only one in my family to have, you know, everyone else had names like Bob, Jeff, Jim, and then Conan, you know. Yeah. You know. Did you, uh, are your, do your siblings have normal names pretty much? Um, well, I have two brothers and a sister. Mm -hmm. uh, my brother's names are Yuri, which he was named after the first Russian astronaut. Right. And Jubal. 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 He's Is he a hillbilly? <laughs> it's actually an old Western name. Sure. It's kind of cool. We hated them when we were kids, but now they're cooler. Um, my sister's name is Sanyata, which is a uh, Buddhist for sacred silence. Right, yes. right. I just, I think of it as Jubal. I've never heard, like I haven't heard a name like Jubal in a while. There's Jubal, I guess there's, there's, a, there's a Jubal in the Civil War, I think Jubal early. Yeah, but, yeah. But that's a very cool name. Yeah, can we get, a, you know, there's a lot of variations, Jubes. Jubes, that's nice. Yeah, you know. <laughs> hey, Jubes, I don't like that one. Did your friends give your family, like, a hard time, or did they have unusual names, too? Well, um, growing up, the way we grew up, we were, I, most of my friends had pretty weird names, too. Mm -hmm. There was, um, let's see, the, the, the crowd we ran with when, we're, when I was a little kid mm -hmm. was, like, Tatanka, Gulliver, um, <laughs> Ooby Dooby. Were these yeah. friends real? <laughs> Um, and uh, and then when I started, I started skateboarding. I mean, mm -hmm. uh, and then the, there were some wild names in there. But I, this, what's the this, wildest this, one? Well, it's it's kind of sad actually that his parents named him this. I had a friend who was on my skateboarding team named Ass, <laughs> and that was actually. <laughs> That's so funny because the first 10 years of my life, I thought that was my name. <laughs> no, it was on his birth certificate. They, what they, were they doing? What I were they don't thinking? know. It's the saddest thing ever. But he kind of embraced it because he was a, like a punk rock kid. Right. And he, got, he had an A shaved into the side of his head. You know, he kind of had to become a punk rock he kid. Had he had no choice. Yeah, had what do you do? I'm an accountant. You know. I, uh, name? I'm a... <laughs> I'll try and help you out. Yeah, I always... I felt real bad for him in the beginning, but then I realized he really liked it. I sure. Mean, he, he embraced it. He, he had, had to. to. Right. He had no choice. Yeah. Now, I was, I was reading about you today, and I heard something interesting that, that, that you have a bit of an obsession. I don't know if that's fair, but you have a bit of an obsession with Kate Winslet. Is that true? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're here to help you. I, yeah. I know. I'm so scared that, pe that she's going to think I'm a stalker because I, I, I just... I'm captivated by her. I think right. she is the most beautiful, mm -hmm. talented, uh, extraordinary actress ever to grace the screen. And I, 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 I watch her movies over and over. Right. It's kind of like one of those kids, how they were with Elvis. I mean, I just, I worship her. And, and you know, I've <laughs> never heard, but it's so weird, I've never heard of one celebrity stalking another, you know? <laughs> You're not returning my calls. <laughs> Well, I I met her I met her once and and I was you know it was I was tongue tied and I right. just, palms were sweating everything the work. Do, do you what else do you, do you have like a picture of her anywhere? I I do have a framed picture of her in my apartment. It's hmm. totally insane. I mean I I feel ter I I mean I don't feel I mean, terrible. You like her work. Well, don't be embarrassed. Yeah, I I just there's something about her that I'm just sort of in love with. I just think she's. She's amazing. We're all obsessed with someone. I was yeah. obsessed with uh, Raj from What's Happening. Oh. Uh, actually, that happens still. I never seen yeah. that show. Oh. I, I we didn't have TV growing up. You were lucky way. that you didn't have TV. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah, but I, I don't want to freak her out, so I, you know. Well, you, one of the things, uh, you, you, in, in the movie Girl Interrupted, 
you actually you sing in the movie. Yes. And one scene, you pick up a guitar, you sing Downtown, Downtown which is, if you're going to know a song on the guitar, that would be a cool one to know. Yeah, but it's very hard, because it has uh, jazz chords in it, which mm -hmm. are hard. Much hard, harder. Especially when you have my hands, which are very small. And But I, I, I practiced a lot. Um, in fact, every day, uh, my friend Alex Rubin, who was uh, the the second unit director I mean literally every day we would practice to really learn the song yeah right. and I got really good at it almost perfect I could perfectly play it and then um, when it, the time came for me to play it I'm not supposed to be very good right and so I had to like not be very good so the director scene. busted your hands yeah and, and then and then what was so sad is that he never panned down to my hands and so I don't know if people know that I was really playing but I'm playing badly so I guess it doesn't matter, doesn't matter. did you do you like to sing do you enjoy singing um, I would never inflict that on anyone I I, 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 I don't that's the big tragedy in my life is that I'm I'm such a fan of music and mm -hmm. it's like the greatest passion in my life besides acting is music but I can't play very well or, or carry a tune but I I just you know it's I'm the same way I would give up everything if I could sing I just yeah. think it would be people that can sing I envy them sing. and I really can <laughs> <laughs> I can't you know but I, I just always think that's the greatest in a way the coolest gift yeah it, it is I mean I well you know Jeff Tweedy mm -hmm. he has I think one of the best voices I think I've ever heard well you bring it up Wilco Wilco. Wilco is on the show, and you're a huge fan of Wilco. I'm the most enormous fan of, so of Wilco. So you're, you're going to do us a favor, and you'll introduce them later on when they're yeah, on the show. Is that, will trying. you do that? Yeah, I'm trying to think of a good thing. I'm nervous. <laughs> I told you, it's not really a TV show. We're like guys that got into our parents' clothes. <laughs> our next guest. Boy, stop that, huh? Uh, Girl Interrupted is uh, is in theaters now, and uh, congratulations on that. Thank People you. People really like this movie, and uh, very cool to have you on the show. Oh, Thanks so much for coming you. here. Winona Ryder, everybody. We'll take a break. We'll be right back. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, here to sing uh, How to Fight Loneliness, a new song from Girl Interrupted and their album Submotif. Uh, the most, uh, one of the most important, greatest, bands of the century. <laughs> My favorite band, Wilco! <laughs>